What's going on YouTube? Geosan right here. So in today's video we have a brand new jailbreak release for iOS 16 and also iOS 15, especially for the ARM64 devices. We're gonna get into that in a second. This video is brought to you by Tenorshare Reboot, a software that allows you to repair your iOS system if it's no longer booting, it's stuck in a update loop, it's in uh, recovery mode or DFE mode, and you can one click reset it as well. There are multiple features available, it supports iOS 17 and there's also a free module to enter the recovery mode. You can definitely check the program out in the link below a free trial is available and there is also a 20% coupon available so as you probably know there is a jailbreak called definitely not a jailbreak tool spelled like this and it's a jailbreak tool for all arm 64 devices on iOS 16.0 up to 16.6.1 but it also supports iOS 15.7 apparently and this one was updated and a brand new release was released a couple of days ago so it says in here definitely not a jailbreak tool version 1.0.0 and it says added iOS 16.6 and 16.6 beta 1 support. Now definitely not a jailbreak tool should be able to jailbreak all ARM64 devices from iOS 16.0 up to 16.6.1 and iOS 16.6 .6 beta 1. Fix the problem on the iOS 16.2 devices and prevent code injection in web content. So that's essentially it. Uh, a couple of weeks ago we got the version 1.0.0 beta 1 stuff like that. So this was in beta for a while. Now this one is the stable version by what appears to be version 1.0.0 and you can get it in IPA format. We can say load this with either side loadly or alt store or even troll store if you are on a compatible version and it's essentially a fully fledged jailbreak available for those devices this is only for arm 64 devices which means the iPhone 10, iPhone 8, 8 Plus, iPhone 7, 7 Plus, and other ARM64 enabled devices like A10, A11, and A9 and stuff like that. And this does support quite a lot of iOS versions going down all the way up to iOS 15.7 by the looks of it. And it's actually based apparently on KFD, KFound, and Dopamine. And of course, you should be able to have proper tweaks and proper Cilio after you install the jailbreak. So if you want to get it, as I said, an IPA is available. It is based on the KFD. Uh, KFD is actually quite interesting because a lot of tools are based on the KFD exploit or range of exploits actually, including Troll Store, especially Troll Store 2. Pretty good toolkit, but the exploit tends to be a little bit dramatic when it comes to the uh, Lambda one, the latest released version. So you should try again if it does fail on you, if it does crash the device, just persist, just try again because it is a little bit flaky. Anyway, as I said, this does support a wide range of iOS versions on the iOS 16 side, so check it out below. Thank you for watching, I am GSNow. Till the next time, subscribe to stay updated and peace out.